has been fun, but I'm also very I'm also very prone to getting squished because I have no way to guard myself. Mm -hmm. That sounds very guts like. <laughs> so, all right, I've done a couple like I've helped. You know, I've, I've gotten summoned into a couple of uh, fights, and mm -hmm. I'm like, I'm gonna say like I'm at like 30% success rate. Okay. So, so I could probably get in there and and get it done. <clears throat> Most of the times, I wasn't the one dying, so. Gotcha. But I could probably summon a few people in and, and get it done. I just haven't. I spent a lot of time exploring that castle, and man, mm -hmm. was was there a lot of stuff to explore in that castle? <laughs> Jeez Louise! A little, a little secret underground bosses, creepy fucking shit. Yeah. I'm climbing on roofs. Crazy. <clears throat> I didn't spend too much time exploring. I kind of just eventually found my way to the boss, as I normally accidentally do. <laughs> Where's this go? Oh. <clears throat> what? You, you you went really front door and just wandered into the boss? Hard to believe. Huh, well, Doesn't it doesn't sound like you at all. It happened. Wow. I'm amazed. Yeah, there's this, uh, the place I'm in right now, I forget the name of it, but it's a cave, and <clears throat> there's, uh, these, the best way to describe it is house centipedes, but instead of legs, or hundreds of legs, they have hundreds of arms with hands that they use for legs. Oh, God. And, like, they will basically shoot upwards around, like, 20 arrows at you in one, like... Volley. That only sounds a little terrifying. Yeah, no, it was kind of fucking disgusting, if I'm being completely honest. Uh, but I eventually found my way to the boss of that, like, area, and the boss is just stupid aggressive. And, like, I could not get in, like, a word in edgewise at all, like, just, like, even just entering the room the first time, like, he rushed me into a corner, and then basically just kept me in that corner and murdered me while I scrambled to do anything. Murdered you while you tried. Right. <laughs> my only saving grace was that my shield is, you know, 100% physical resistant. Yeah. And then, but, you know, watching my stamina just deplete, and then getting yeah. stunlocked, I'm like, well... <laughs> I mean, do, do, you, uh, do you use the uh, counter mechanic a lot? Uh, no. <laughs> Did you know there was a counter mechanic? Yes, I'm familiar with Dark Souls and their counter mechanic, and, or parry mechanic, or whatever you want to call it, but uh, as I've proven... That's not what I was asking. <laughs> As I've proven with many games, I suck <laughs> at the counter parry mechanic window. Uh, it's I'm not even. It's a different mechanic than the parry. Oh well, then no, I wasn't aware. When you block, if you hit the the R two, um, you can counter. Okay. Is there a specific okay. window or? I mean, after you get your shield gets it. <laughs> Like, how tight is the window? Uh, you just jam on the button, man. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Right. At least that's what I do. There, there's, like, no timing. It's just, like, you get hit, and, like... Like, you can just jam on the R2, and it'll it'll just happen. Gotcha. It's, it's not, like, a specific timing. I mean, it has to happen after um, you get hit, but... Yeah, that was one of those things they talked about in the tutorial. <laughs> yeah. I was like, I spotted that out. I was like, oh, that's neat. And I, I did it. But I did consider doing a uh, 
Just like a tanky build with like a big shield. Mm -hmm. Oh, if I remember the next time I play, I will, I will try your counter mechanic. There we go. I am bringing the sit stone ore back to me. All right. Well, what? don't come through for a gypsrosis. Gyps roasting all over. Detection bias prowler. That could be fun. Yeah. I think I, I, I forget. I think I mentioned it before, but the last time I played this game, I, I mained prowler, and it was and it very entertaining. And also awesome because I didn't have to worry about the equipment. <laughs> One of these uh, streams, we'll have to just go through and do all the prowler quests. Yeah, I should. Uh, I will try to have some a prowler somewhat ready for that. I was just gonna use Narga. <clears throat> I don't have. Um, I think I think the one I have equipped right now is a gathering one because I was like, ah, whatever. Mm. I don't think that would make a very good um, prowler. I guess. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> well, there seems to be a severe lack of IO prey around. Prowler is a weapon type, but there are specific quests you can only go on as a prowler. They're, they're locked out for the hunters. Ghastly. That's all we were talking about. Although I don't know, I thought it was in multiplayer? Yeah. Is it just single player? Okay. Yeah. I I've, I've been ignoring them. Gotcha. Uh, I no, just got I good. Get out of my... Get out of <coughs> my prowlers. Or not prowlers. God damn it. You got to call the IO for your prowlers. <laughs> Alright, what button do I press that doesn't make me drop the sit stone right at the box? <laughs> gotcha. So what I'm hearing is I should come kick you real quick. I would. <laughs> I would make this quest that much longer. I'm like, you're gonna wait. <laughs> I'd just kill oh. the. Oh god. Yeah. Did you take that first sip? I it... No, I took. I, I just took a, a different sip, and it, it was not. It was not good. It sounded it great. Sick. Sounded like you want more of it. Oh god. Okay. Now I know you gave me this beer. Oh yeah. Cause it tastes like ass. It was okay for like the first couple of sips, but I just took one and it was gross. It tastes like licking someone's asshole. I wouldn't go that far. It just tasted like. <laughs> I was gonna say, is it because people actually enjoy licking asshole? <laughs> is that, that. <laughs> don't don't yuck, don't yuck other people's yum. <laughs> But nobody's nobody's gonna enjoy that beer because it's garbage. <laughs> Yikes! I don't even think I can say what beer it is now because you're insulting it so badly. <laughs> you already did. <laughs> Damn. <clears throat> well, it it might have been on one of the good. previous streams, or at least previous attempts tonight. But uh, yeah, previous attempts for sure. <laughs> Oh, oh boy! <laughs> Look, when I eat, when I drink something that's called peppermint bark, I expect to taste peppermint, <laughs> not. I mean, I, I, mean, I taste the peppermint. <laughs> it just also there's like a weird aftertaste. I don't know. Maybe it's just a bad batch or something. Cause usually this company does good beer, like they're pretty solid. So I'm surprised this one it tastes as weird as it does. 
But any of these weird, like, flavored ones, it's like, oh, it's like they're, either a f they're either fucking amazing or they're fucking awful. Like, there's nothing in between. Like, my favorite beer is uh, by a place called Southern Tier that does a creme brulee. And it's fucking uh, delicious. I mean... It's super strong, and I have to sip it. But I... it's fucking delicious. It sounds delicious with a name like creme brulee. Oh, yeah, it's great. Just um, man. They, have a, they have a nitro version of it, which isn't as good, I think. But uh, it's all right. <laughs> what does it's nitro do for one. your beer? Uh, it's like it's like a little like fizzy infusion thing. I don't know. It's kind of like gimmick, honestly. Gotcha. It basically gives you more foam in the the beer. Ah, and more air in it, so it kind of makes it a little lighter. But that's that's not why I drink that beer, so I don't like it as much. <laughs> gotcha. Um, there's also I got surprised by a co by a uh, company called Pipeworks. Okay. They did a. Did two of them. I didn't like one of them at all, which was a tiramisu. Oh, that's beer. sad because it sounds tasty. Uh, the it because of the coffee, it just like amped up the bitterness. Ah. So, like, 